Oh, hello YouTube. Um, well, I my missus said it's okay for me to um, make this video. I thought it would make me look like a crazy person a bit, but we'll see. <laughs> look, think what you like, but I, I think the, look, I think the rise of wokeism and crazy people is, and I think if you did the math, it wouldn't really be that hard to figure out especially when you consider what it is, um, that um, plastics are the reason for the rise of crazy people, beta males, and wokeism. Um, I think that's pretty obvious. Um, and why I say that is because when you see, since the introduction of plastics um, from probably... 60s or 70s when it started becoming more um, used for containers for food um, that um, yeah, that that there was a decrease in the male testosterone so we know that there's been a statistical decrease in the male testosterone over the decades um, I think since about the 60s that's been um, there's also been, I saw in a video, I didn't know this, but apparently the male uh, scrotum has shrank in on average. Um, obviously with the decrease of testosterone, I suppose that makes sense, but <coughs> um, so less manly men, I guess you could say, um, at least with that. Um, and if you look at the way people behave, um, ever since the introduction of plastics, people's general uh, consensus and brain is, has changed dramatically, um, not necessarily for the better. Um, so think about that. Um, I guess, you know, you could say that in the way people think um, is, yeah, they've just gone more insane. Um, <clears throat> another thing you can consider with all of this is the fact that plastic is made from petroleum, um, so oil. Um, so plastic is a byproduct of a carcinogenic. Carcinogenics give you cancer. So um, yeah, something to think about. And we all know that microplastics shred off in from regular plastics. Like they're talking about chemical structures. Um, Micro, microscopic um, uh, objects, which probably would uh, to a microorganism would appear like a like a skyscraper or something like it would be massive. But to us, looking through like a microscope or something, we, we it would appear very small, like we wouldn't really see. It. But we also know that it does happen. So um, yeah, and um, yeah. So look. Um, that's my personal opinion, is that because of the rise of plastics, it has brought on the rise of insanity and wokeism. I mean, look, when you look at people who, yeah, I mean, you look at their behaviour and, and what's important to them now and how they act, I mean, it's, it's not really hard to work out that, you know, the values people had and the way, you know, and the way people think and... It's just, it's all gone insane. So, um, you know, it, it really has. It, it, look, I mean, you can say what you want about me, but I mean, I think the evidence is there. I think if somebody did a study on it, I think they would find it's probably pretty correct, actually. So that's basically, let me repeat. So we've, we've I've said it three times, so it sticks in your head. The reason wokeism, um, or woke behaviour, beta males, and this insanity um, has basically increased is from the rise of plastics in food. I think if we got rid of plastics in food, I think there would be a more uptake of, uh, well, let's start with testosterone in males, and we will say less inclined behaviour mentally because they won't have all these tiny plastics affecting their brain um, in acting like crazy people and they'll probably act more like sane people but um, 
just think about it really I mean look at people maybe do the experiment at, at your own place and see uh, who's the most crazy and how much plastic they have in their life versus the most sane person that you can think of there and how much plastic they have in their life I mean just have a look in your own workplace just be like all right do they drink from a plastic bottle every day do they um, do they eat food from a plastic container that's been wrapped in plastic and cooked in plastic and blah 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 just think about it just think about it it's, look it's it's in our everyday life and look I use it all the time everyone else uses it all the time but it's just something to think about is that the cause please